Siniana Hill is the little school that could. We're in the business of meeting students where they are academically and in four and often five years getting them prepared for college. Our philosophy is simple. By giving the students the tools they need to be successful, we can close the achievement gap. How we do this though is not so simple. Coming from a myriad of middle schools all over the city of Boston, City on a Hill students often come dreadfully behind, most earning failing 8th grade MCAS scores. That means that we have only two years to get students ready for the 10th grade MCAS in English, Math, and Science. When compared to other districts in Massachusetts on the 10th grade MCAS exam, City on a Hill excels in student growth. Of 288 districts calculated, City on a Hill ranked in the top five for math for the past four years and in the top 10 for English language arts for three of our last four years. The City on a Hill program has proven that with the right supports in place, students can achieve high academic growth in a very short period of time. The City on a Hill formula includes many things. We have an extended school day, an extended school year, and Saturday school. We also run our own summer school and have Freshman Academy for all incoming ninth graders. We provide tutorial for all students, have small class sizes, have support for students who aren't passing their classes, and also run an MCAS prep program. I wasn't a very good student in my middle school. I was kind of a class clown, goofing off all the time. My middle school experience was a struggle. I didn't want to participate, and I just had a tough time. And there was only probably one teacher that really cared if I learned something. As the year went on, I started catching up, and my English got better. They, they gave me teachers, especially Ms. Richardson and Ms. Ravello, who helped me a lot. MCAS, um, middle school, had all needs improvement. And for math and, for math and English, and at City on the Hill, I had, for math and English, I got proficient. Sophomore year was when I met Ms. Richardson and she started helping me with my readings. And I think that's, and then I started growing. I started making progress on my reading. And now I'm doing good. City on the Hill is different academically because the teachers want their, their students to, to learn. As I came to City on the Hill, they, the work that I was doing and the help that I was getting made me, made me feel like I was a new person. It made me feel more responsible of how, my, how I was doing my grades. Made me check up on teachers, like check up on my grades with them. As a student, City on the Hill has changed me in a lot of ways. All students can and will be accepted to college. We make only one promise to incoming freshman families. If you stick with us and our core program, your students will not only get into college, but will be prepared to complete college. All students in all grades are engaged in a college prep curriculum. But college journey really starts junior year here at City on a Hill. In junior year, in advisory, students are engaged in a junior seminar class. In this class, they are engaged in choosing what college would be the best fit for them, finding out about that college, and what it takes to get into each college. During their senior year, they are involved in one-on-one -on -one college counseling, coupled with a mandatory senior seminar class. In this class, students are engaged in the application process and also work with their college counselor to find scholarships, and again, a college that would be suitable for them. As a result of this, we have made good on our promises to families for the past 16 years, with 100% of our graduates being accepted into college. Ms. Fink and Ms. Kratzak, my guidance counselors, they knew I loved neuroscience. So every single, during my college application process, they only helped me to find schools that had strong programs in neuroscience. And so I ended up applying to schools that would help me succeed. It's an awesome school. You get to know everyone. They all support you. They know your aspirations, your dreams. It's, it's City on the Hill. City on the Hill alumni not only go to college, they graduate and excel in their professional life. Linda Pierre, from the class of 2008 and one of my advisees, has come back to work at City on the Hill as one of our tutors. So, yeah, I graduated in 2008, and it was great being a student in a different school environment. I went to Smith College, which is the best women's college, and when I was deciding, okay, what should I do after college, I said I wanted to come back 
and learn the structure of the school from a different angle. I want to start my own school in the future. I want to help Haitian refugees um, who seem like or feel like they have no hope. I feel like City on a Hill did a great job in helping me see how I can affect my community. And the fact that, you know, they see that I came back to help them, I hope that motivates them to see that they can come back and make a change in their community as well. As a result of City on a Hill's programs and supports, all of our students will be prepared for college. They will attend schools like UMass, Colby Sawyer, and Wolseley College. They will become teachers, police officers, nurses, and public servants. All of us here at City on the Hill are honored and thrilled to be a part of their journey.